quarter to 11 in the morning. We're going bowling later on, folks, but Ben decided in his infinite wisdom to come out and walk the dogs in weather like this. Have a look at this sea, look. Wow, look how choppy that is, people. And then we can see, we're just above the uh, Murray Golf Course here. Pouring down with rain, Benji. Yes. We're getting wet because I haven't got a hood. Well, that's more for you. You've come it? prepared. I always prepared. So we just finished this little walk. I've got to go home now, dry out, before I catch pneumonia, Benji. <laughs> yeah? <laughs> and uh, we'll see you a bit later when we're bowling. We're yeah. going to have some fish and chips as well, but I might be having the bad. chips. You said there's a great fish and chip shop in... Um... Not great. Well, what are you taking us to somewhere inferior for? I don't know, I've never been. What do you mean big? Large portion? Do you want a large portion? I don't know, I'm not that hungry. Ah. Alright folks, let's get over, he's boring me now. Oh, See sorry. you further down the line. You leave Benji, I don't know where I am. Oh, no, Hello baby. Hello. We're going bowling today, aren't we? Yeah, look, I can't just get this cold. Cold, look, we're going to pins over there, look. We've never been here before, and it seems like there's loads of people here as well, folks. So, uh, the party's just finishing it, the James. Oh, it's just a party, of course, there is. We're meeting Tracy in there, so we'll see you inside, folks. It's a bit noisy in here, Sharon, isn't it? Hello, Tracy. Hey. How are you? Hi, we You've been to a kid's party, haven't you? Yeah, we just finished. So, this is Pins, apparently. Uh, we'll have a good look around in a minute, folks. We're just going to get organised, we'll get inside, get paid, and all that lot, and uh, we'll see you in a minute. In here, shall we? Have to be careful with copyright. Right, we're on lane number one, folks. So I don't know how we're going to play this. What are we doing, Tracy? Okay. Bowling. All having a little bowl each. Yeah. Right. Still put the names up in a second. Yeah, they put the names up in a second. There we go. Martin, Ben, George, Emily, <coughs> James, and Mummy. Right. So we you only allowed six to a lane, Tracy. Is that right? Yeah, yeah. So Mum and I are just going to share. Yeah. And Ben's got all competitive, Tracy. Oh, well, you've got to. Have yeah, well, you know what he's like, but I'll have to turn him down a bit. I can't have him getting all offensive if he uh, if he loses. He'll get offensive if he Yeah, don't want him stropping, Tracy. He'll stop oh! <laughs> Come on in, let's get going. Well, I'm going first, folks. Never played for about 20 years now. Something like that, innit? Any of these? Oh, I'm not going to have a pay-go, but I'm out of shoes. Right. Yeah. 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 Straight down the middle. Not bad. Not bad, Benji. You get another go, Ben. Yeah. Oh, he struck it. He struck it. Good start. Straight down the middle, George. Any time of day. Don't get undressed. Oh yeah, I love it. Oh, hold on, look. What's happened there? That's cheating. Just go over it, George. We've only got, only got an hour, mate. No, no good. Oh, that could be good, Emily. That could be good. 
Tracy, remember what I taught you. Go for it. Right. Another go. Oh, mommy's having a go. Come on, Sharon. Remember what I taught you, Sharon. Go on, baby. Up you go. Straight down the middle, Sharon. Yeah, I see you left bias there. You went left bias. Never mind. How did you feel after your first throw? Oh, it aches. Good. Oh, yeah, very good, Ben. Very good. I love your concentration. That's unlucky. Unlucky, Benji. Right, Ben's uh, winning at the moment. He's got 60, I've got 24. George has got 20. The rest are below. Mummy's got 22. It's not been our best game, Sharon, has it? I'm a loser. You're a loser. You two have teamed up as a pair though, haven't you? Yeah. yeah. And he's actually storming away. You think you're a professional, didn't you? No, I did good. You know what's putting me off? What? The, the garlic bread. Oh, yes. Yeah, <laughs> had the curry last night, didn't he? I think he's done it intentionally, Sharon. Yeah. I was picking the balls up. I didn't have big enough holes. I was, fingers. I was only grasping it like a claw. Like a claw. What? I missed it. Yeah. They're all different sizes, I didn't realise the holes were big. Some have big holes, I thought it's just the weights that were different. I'll pick up now, Tracy, don't worry. Yeah, yeah, Come on, Shia. Do it for the team. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. Tracy? Off you go, Tracy. Don't take any advice from you, Shia, put you wrong. Any tight day, Tracy? Yeah. Useless. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. This is our last go for this round. Ben's well in front. <laughs> yes, I am. minutes we booked an hour didn't we they only give us a beating yeah well originally we had booked for a game each right then we found it was cheaper to book for an hour but they didn't change it on the computer oh right but it's going back on oh. well ben you won that one anyway didn't you easily by 44 points shell we're coming back baby yeah we are time to get stuck in folks stuck in Ball selection. <laughs> Join it. 
strike it, Benji. Oh, it's a good shot. Yeah. <laughs> Unbelievable. Unbelievable. <laughs> Go on in, Nelly. Go on, Mummy. Tracy. Pick your ball, Tracy. Make it look like you know what you're doing. Unbelievable. Well, we didn't win, Chow. What, what do you reckon about first time in bowling in years? Not bad. Benji won it though, didn't he? Yeah. Let's go have some fish and chips. Ricky's coming, switch it off. Oh. Hey? Yeah, all right, you won. All right. It's only a friendly anyway. Well, we're at the uh, car park. They've, they've actually got a car park, Ben, oh. of Ash, Ashfowl fish and chip shop folks. Look. Who's that? He couldn't leave you in the car, Sharon. Sharon, it's actually got its own car park. It's got to be good, isn't it? Are we eating in? I think we're better. And this is it here, people. Ash, Ashvale Fish Restaurant and Takeaway. Looking forward to this, Sharon. How do, oh, God, that's the problem, Sharon. Well, oh, have they got rock here, Sharon? Who knows? They got a what? Had a jumbo supper meal for two. Meal two. Oh yeah, but I can't that? have chips, yeah. How do you see that? No. You anyway. See that? On the board, up the top. On the top there, she can read everything. She's got laser yeah, vision, Sharon, haven't you? Oh, take them off, no, I haven't. No, I know. Mm. It's open, baby. Yeah. They do a jumbo haddock, Sharon. Yeah. Oh, Waiting in the restaurant, where's your way in? Look at that, Ben. That's nice, mayonnaise. that picture, isn't it? Look behind Orange, you. Mayonnaise. Looks like, oh, that's the uh, town centre, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, look at the old cars there, look. Yeah. Back in the 1970s or 60s, maybe. Yeah, I know. I don't know what that is, mate. Look at that. So we're in our seat, and look what's on the table. I wonder if that's complimentary, Sharon. Of course it is, if it's on the Ben's table. Trying to I know what he's doing. He's trying to wind me up, isn't he? I know exactly what his game was, Sharon. Tracy. Look at this. Yeah. Look, so we've got... Oh, hello. Oh, thank you. Oh, is that for us? Oh, you could have that. <laughs> <laughs> thank you. That's good, isn't it? Oh, that's oh yeah. Nice. Yeah, hey? Look at that. <laughs> you put them in the middle. Well, think there. of the adults. That's nice, isn't it, sure? Again, so we've got uh, tartar sauce here. We've got yeah. Heinz tomato ketchup. You've got I'm HP, I'm Sharon, I'm brown sauce. You've got mayonnaise there. Did you say tartar? Eh? Tartar. Yeah, I said that. And also another one down the other end. Can I have a look at the mess room? That's a special one. Deals. One course, two course, three course. Oh, there you go. That's not bad, is it? There you go. Sorry, guys. Yeah, can I just have a look? Look, there's an eating challenge. An eating challenge. That's that uh, one we saw in the window, folks. Look. Won't be doing that on my phone. I just don't have, if you go to a fish and chip shop, you don't have chips. Yep. I can't, if they'd done a fish Weird. shop, I'd be going there. Weird, isn't it? Fish and chips, so you don't right, eat chips. I don't care. They'll all be picking up on me, me chips. Shout, right. you're on holiday, baby. Yeah. You're allowed a treat now and again. I've been bold enough. I've it off already. Why you bold, didn't What's that, Tracy? She even let she the ball go behind her. Yeah, she, she, went the wrong she threw the ball, she no pulled her arm back. Do that trick. And uh, the ball went behind her. Oh, I've never <laughs> seen that done before. <laughs> can't say that now, can we? Well, here it is, folks, and um, before mine gets demolished, because I'm not having the chips or the peas, I'm having the large haddock there, and I've also ordered a cheeky little sausage batter on the side, Benji. That's for me. Let's have a closer look at it, people. You're going in 
with a little bit of um, lemon. lemon on your fish yeah? Yep. Them chips look nice, even though I'm not eating chips. But they are uh, very tasty. Go on, in, have a go, baby. Oh, yeah. oh yes, please. Thank oh, you, you want some much. scraps, didn't you? Lovely. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, thank you. Not dead. No, yep. oh, yeah. Thank you. Thought you meant the fish then. <laughs> 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 go on, Cher. Thank you very much. You're welcome. That's had it, by the way. Mm. Any good? Like crispy batter. That's nice. Very what about nice. the chips? They look good as well, Sharon. Okay. With a single pea on it. Very good. Not yeah. greasy at all. Right, coming in, Ben. Here we go, your fish. You like a bit of mayo on yours, don't you? Oh, yeah, I do. Mayo and mush and peas. Oh, fill it in. Go on. That's like a full metal jacket, Ben. Mm. Mm. Well, any good? Tasty. Try the curry sauce, shall we? It's lovely. I've I have just tried it. Got a bit of kick to it. Very nice. Is it really? Mm. Can I have a little go, shall No. Right, so I'm going to put some um, salt and vinegar on my fish. As you can see, my fish looks totally different now. Uh, where's the salt here? The thing I like is Sharon got the biggest one. She did get the biggest <laughs> bit, and I, and I thought she would have said, oh no, you have the biggest bit, but she didn't. <laughs> You've got sausage in butter. Hey, lucky I did, wouldn't it? Can I, is there any pepper there? No. No, okay, never mind. It's probably a little pepper too. Right, let's have a go at this fish then. It's quite a thick bit of fish. I always find it awkward holding these fish Ooh. knives. Fish slices. What's it? your fish and you got in common? Go on. Thick. <laughs> Let's have a little look, look. It's a nice chunky bit of fish that folks look. And what are you moaning about then? I'm not moaning, sure. I'm, I'm describing it, baby. Mm. Mm. Let's cut into that. Just get it in your gizzard. Now, it's skin off as well, Sharon. Yeah, just eat. Come oh. on. Oh, oh. It's thick, it's succulent, moist. I love that word, Tracy. Description. <laughs> Absolutely lovely. Well, we're going to sit down and enjoy this now, folks. Little cheeky sausage in batter on the side because I've got a little bit of fish. We'll see you in a minute. was absolutely superb. Benji, it was even better for you because I played. Yeah, yeah, cheers for that. Unbelievable. Do you want to play uh, what's a, fire No, engine? we're playing Fire Edges, Ben. <laughs> that was superb, people. That was very nice. Thank you, Benji. Thank you. What did uh, you think of that fish, Tracy? Yeah, it was lovely. I highly recommend this. Yeah, I do, I do. Can we give it a score? I'll give it a 10 straight away, it wasn't yep. it was, The service was actually excellent. Yeah, yeah seven Very six, attentive. Six and yeah, yeah, yeah I've never had that before. She actually came around and said, would you like extra chips? Fantastic, it wasn't it? And they did smaller portions, it was perfect for me. Yeah, they've done smaller, that's probably a pensioners portion, Tracy. Probably. Perhaps I should have had that. <laughs> Unbelievable. These are all complimentary, which I've never seen before. Lovely. Fantastic. I would have liked to try that whale well one. I did. I wasn't going to order it, Sharon, wasn't I? Yeah. But they didn't have none left in stock. I was going to have the pound of fish. Oh, probably I bet would... you know why. Why? Moby Dick's been in. <laughs> I probably wouldn't have been able to eat it all, but Ben was going to go help me out because yeah, he had extra chips so. as well, didn't you? Yeah. So we didn't have to pay for that. It was a, a restaurant. Fantastic. And takeaway. Well. And a takeaway as well, yeah, with its own car park here. Absolutely superb. And the fish was nice and thick, how I like it. And it was had it, Ben. Yeah, it was. Had they it didn't worked. put the cod down on the menu, I noticed, but uh, maybe they don't do cod. Maybe not. We never know, will we? No. Anyway. Never. We're going to do a few taste tests later. Oh, hello. Right. A few taste tests later there. on, shall we? Yep. And uh, we'll bring you along for that. We've got some stuff to taste. See you at home. Right, it's night time. It's, uh, well, it's tea time, shall we? Mm. But we're going to do this little bit of a taste testing, folks, because we bought some stuff from Anderson's Butchers the other day. And uh, we wanted to give it a little bit of a taste. Now, a lot of them, Shao, have been on about this stow. What's it called? Black pudding. Storn away. Storn away black pudding. That's McLeod and McLean. Yeah. But this is the one everyone says you've got to try that because it's very uh, nice. It's also very dear, Shao, because that cost us £9, didn't it? Normally, you can get a whole tube about that oh, long yeah. for about £3 or something in. Um, 
like brookers when we go for the catering places or whatever but uh that's what that is folks so we're going to be trying a bit of that we're also going to be trying some MS haggis scottish haggis again this is very low carb as well 227 grams only provides 1.4 grams of sugars which basically is about about 10 calories right so that's nothing in that whole that's half of that packet basically yeah 10 calories of sugar which is nothing we've also got what are these salt and pepper shredded chicken turn it around i can't see the label baby yeah and again this come from the anderson's butcher that's all pre-done is it spicy what is it salt and pepper you said wouldn't it yeah. shredded chicken that would be a bit spicy. and we've also got if we just bring these forward yeah. now these are pork balls which have been wrapped in bacon and apparently in the middle is a peppercorn sauce so i don't know how they got it in there they could have injected it or they could have frozen the peppercorn sauce and then molded the rest of it around it so right let's get these in the uh the air fryer first yeah i'll bring them over here baby we won't put no um liners in there or nothing so we'll just put them two on there and we, oh by the way my daughter's actually changed her rubber seal on her ninja by the way those of you who have trouble with with it sealing it stops sealing for some reason she changed the rubber seal on it so um nice simple job i didn't do it her husband done it god knows how he managed it anyway so on with the um the air fryer so i'm just going to turn the kasori dual blaze on i'm probably going to do them at 180 shower for 20 minutes and turning them halfway you put some of these in now i've got the other oven ready for that baby i thought we'd just toss that bag open because i've already lined the uh, tray here look, for them to go on there and they can go in the um the oven can't they i did wash my hands of course you did baby so we're just going to plonk them on there i think they'll go on there yeah that's all right right let's wait them in the uh kasori mini oven shall i'll open the door for you take part put them in the second tray i think yeah well done and these i think we'll whack them ones on at 200 degrees and we'll do them for uh 15 minutes i think again we, if we have to adjust the time folk not a problem we don't want it to preheat not worried about that press it again and that starts that thing cooking as well someone said they thought that this sounded a bit loud but the reason being is because she's got a tray stuck behind there and it's echoing the sound so we'll take that off and take that off as well yeah so that's that done sharon so let's yeah you can have this i'll do that for you so different ways to do the haggis. You can boil it, which is for about an hour and a half, Sharon. Isn't it? No, that was cooking the oven for an hour and a half, hour and twenty I mean. minutes. Yeah. Put it in some water, like, yeah, like a, a bain marie. Bain marie. Stick that. Take the label off it. You can leave it in the plastic coating. Put it in the oven for an hour and a half. We're not going to bother doing that. You can do it in the microwave as well. But we're just going to do it the same way as we're going to do the black pudding, Sharon, which is cut it into discs. So I'm just going to cut that end off. Straight through. One. I'm going to treat this exactly the same way as a black pudding. They're not going to show you, they're not going to show you, don't do that. Shall? This is how I'm doing it. Be happy, shall I cut it all up? Yeah. I suppose everyone will want to try a bit, won't they? It's only taste tested at the end of the day, that's what we're doing. Yeah. There's a lot of people saying, shall, when we've done the. Um, black pudding the other black pudding some people say oh you've got to leave that on and cook it with that on then pull it off afterwards That's right do half and half well no because I, other people have said oh no you definitely got to take it off so I'm just going to do what I did before and take it off I don't like the idea of plastic heating up in a frying pan near to your food sort of thing you know so I will take them off and as I say this was bargain this was about two pounds ain't you wasn't it mm. This was a reduced price, mind you, but um, I don't know what the full price would have been. So they just slip off nice and easy. That's quite a thick one. Well, here we are. Tracy's come out now to join us. You come to have a little go? Yeah, only yeah. a little go. So, right, well, we've cut a load of agus up. and we've Agus? All, agus. No, agus. Agus. With a couple of A. Capital A. Capital A. And we've also cut the uh, black pudding up as well. We've also got a disc of... The other black pudding, yeah, which we've, um, yeah, it? you can see the difference. The uh, stone, is it stone? Uh, I, I can't remember what it's oh, called it again. Nice. I think you should start getting some on now because of the. I'm going to start the getting the on, shall yeah. So get the big hob on, shall I've got the frying pan ready. 
There we go. We'll whack that on. Oh, hello. Oh, Got it? No. Oh, it's very hot, isn't it? Right, so we'll let that heat up. And they say, put it in without any oil or anything, don't they? That's the black pudding. I don't know about the haggis. I thought it said about the haggis. No, I was reading about the bad bad Anyway, bad Tracy? Yeah. Let's get a few of them in there, baby. Oh, sorry, I'm not ready for this. What oh. do you want in there? Bad yeah, well, the one at the back is a haggis. Put yeah, the haggis in first, I think that's going to yeah. take longer, isn't it? We can do it in batches. We'll put some in of each. So we put about four in of one and four in of the other. How about that? Three. Can you count the four? Five. <laughs> there we go. And put that other little disc in the middle as well. No, keep going. Keep going. That's the black pudding going in as well now. And that uh, that other disc, that's the one. That's the darker one in it, which is the um, just the standard black pudding Supermarket there. Supermarket one. Supermarket. Is well, is it M and S? I can't remember. It was still tasty anyway. But let's just packet? see what they go like. Right, Sharon's just having a little measure of her balls. What? What are we up to there? Forty-five. No, we've still right. got going for longer. Perhaps turn them over as well a bit, Sharon. Oh, have done. Oh, yeah. Okay. So they may need to go in. Oh no, that six minutes might be enough, Sharon, mightn't it? Yeah. yeah, so we've got about three minutes to go on the. Um, I think they're done, shall we? Yeah, I think they're done. We'll just shut it off for a minute. Just have a look at this, shall we? Might as well just turn it up a tad, maybe. Let's just turn it up a little tad. Oh, hello. Yeah, just to get the pan warm. And uh, hopefully. Look at the colour, shall That's pretty. That's beautiful. Hey. Speechless yeah. Now again, this is literally a taste test, and one other thing we've got over the back there, shall, is that uh, mayonnaise. Now, someone did alert us that um, ah, ah. alert Tesco's <laughs> also do an avocado oil mayonnaise, and this was actually cheaper than the other one we was getting, and we found it, didn't we, in Elgin? Yes. And it's Dr. Will's all natural avocado oil mayonnaise. So someone in the comments section actually made, uh, left a comment saying that they actually made some as well and it's very simple, very quick. I've looked on the uh, YouTube, yeah it's very simple and quick, it's just that we've not got around to it yet. And also the thing is we know it's avocado oil is yeah. very expensive Yeah. and it's cheaper to buy that. And, <laughs> and yeah that's right, and uh, we don't eat it in large quantities so there's no need for us to make a large batch up. Oh hello. Oh. This, oh, this, this is a Cypress cat please. Yeah, so every, 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 every pet is Cypress. Babies. She's lovely. This is Bella. You you actually birthed her, didn't I you? I did, her and her sister. Yeah. I've already been told in the comment section, Shao, that I'm not a bleeding cook. I rush about too much. You're the cook. I just orchestrate everything. Wow. Anyway. Have a juice. Yeah, can I have one, Shao? you make me one, baby? Hey, look, yeah, sure. I'll have one, if you don't mind me making me one. Oh, I don't drink juice, do I? I'll have a fizzy water. You're silly. <laughs> I'll have a silly water, silly water. I'll have a fizzy water. Oh, it's one you prepared earlier. Do you want that? Or do you want yes, I do want that. Yes, that'd be fine. Have you got any ice cubes, Tracy? I'll oh, just have one out of the fridge. Have one at the bottom of the Okay. Do you want that? No, fridge. don't bother. No, that, right. that, that little noise you made there and no. that facial expression. No, there's a bottle there open to fizzy water. Oh, yes, I'll have a couple of, of cold fizzy I water. I need some ice. I don't like that glass. You don't like that glass? I don't like unstable. That. It's got to be a straight glass. Hey? It's unstable, isn't it? I don't like it. It wobbles about too much. That's not a pint, yeah? Well, it's no more pint, yeah. Oh, no. Where? Is that not acceptable? Oh, you, you're going in. Is that okay? Un under duress, I'll have that with you. Oh, my God, how do you paint? <laughs> just need to get the ice. Oh, oh you got a shell? Bowl. I'll have a ice, don't worry. Let, let her look after us. Into that shell, fridge. when we get a bit older, she'll have to look after us like this anyway. Now, good amount of heat on there. We've perhaps overloaded the pan a little bit too much, shell. I'm not too worried about that. See the haggis just starting to try and fall apart. That's the... actually black pudding. No, there, I've just touched it accidentally. Because oh. it's it's quite closely uh, in there, isn't it? Is this going to be fizzy enough? It will be, darling. Sure, yeah. Yeah, oh, hello. Yeah, you've got to be careful with this because it will break. It's come up. lower. You get lower, Shell. Yeah. I tell you what, it smells lovely. It does, doesn't it? Mm. I found chow, yeah, look, just pushing up the side and then flipping it, look. Oh, aren't you a legend? Well, yeah, I've never cooked before. No, it's just, it's, you, <laughs> find, you find all these little tricks as you go along, don't you? Look, look, push up, flip it, look. Flip it? Saves me, um, breaking it all up sort of thing. Look, push it up the side, just flip it over like that, look. I'll tell you what, that's nearly done, isn't it? That one is the, uh, the original one there, sitting over there. It's a little bit darker, Sharon, isn't it? 
So I just spent a little bit more on this side, and I think that'll be done, Tracy. Oh, lovely. Yeah. So we've just got the balls to do. The chicken's already done. Dr. Will's mayonnaise. I'm not saying we'll be testing it with this, but we may just taste a bit. Have you got anything to dip in that, Tracy? What, well, like a teaspoon? Well, you can put a teaspoon in there. Put it down upon the plate. I've got yeah, to do. I'm do it that way. But it'd be nice to savour it, uh, sample it. With the chicken thing? Oh, yeah. We can do it with the chicken things. Not for me. No, hey? I'm asking you. No, I don't like mayo. You're behind the, behind the camera today. <laughs> you're, you're directing, Sharon. We're tasting. Yeah. But they said they like seeing me and Tracy. Oh, all right. Are you happy now? Yeah, how what about you? me? I like being in on it as well. Oh, it's a girl's thing. Oh, no, say that. What a lovely picture, isn't it? What's that song? Something's burning. What? I'm Rose between two falls. Ciao. Get Chow. your probe out. I can hear it bleeping. What are you doing with these then? Right, they're nearly ready. Just stick that in there in the middle, shall we? 47. 51. We're looking for about 75, folks. 74. 75, do the other one, baby. Yeah, baby. Keep that one in there for a minute, yeah? Yeah, try and plate them on the, put them on a plate, Tracy. Oh, or do you just want to plate everything on here? Oh, Gordon, you hold that then. Come on, I'll do that, because I know I've got a technique, oh, don't I? have got a technique, yeah. That one's gone down. So, I'm just going to remove that from the heat, people. Because we're at the stage now, I can't, oh yeah, that was the big one, wasn't it? Look, flip, on. Genius. Black pudding, on. That. Haggis. Haggis, on. Now that one there, the rogue one, I'm going to put that at the bottom, okay? Okay. We'll just drop these in for the minute, these other ones. Yep. It's a lot of food for a taste test. Well, Why? Ben wanted some as well, didn't he? wanted to try as well, didn't they? So right. you don't see, isn't it? These two on screen together. Eh, eh? Okay. Right, okay, I think the balls are done, shall we? Oh yeah, look at them. Have you got any ting tongs or should we just... Uh... Ting tongs in there. So I can just lift it up like this, hold on. Stay there, shall we? I'll spear and jackson it. Here we go, that's one. Oh, that's hot, isn't it? And there's a second one there, look at that. Wow, that's a good selection of food there, folks. And where's the salt and pepper, Tracy? Dining room. What, what do you mean? Chicken. No, the salt and pepper chicken. Oh! <laughs> salt and pepper's in the dark. I like it, it is! I need to get the gloves. I'm not you. I don't have asbestos hands. Oh, go on and get them out. Oh, look at them. Oh, lovely. What a, what a lovely little combination. Sure. Leave them on there, Trace. Are you happy with that, yeah? Well, I don't, oh, think, we need, I don't think we need to take them off. Turn Right, let's have a closer look at them, folks. Uh, yeah, you could undo the mayo, Tracy. We'll have a little go with that, shall we? Break the seal. Oh, hello. Ready? Hmm. Do you want to put a bit on a little plate or something? Or? Not really. I thought you were going to dip your um, thing in it. Try the chicken strips first of all, eh? What are you going to plonk now? I do like watching the back of you, Tracy. Remove them. There you go. <laughs> yeah. Simple, uh, isn't it? Yeah, okay, that'll do. Put it there for now. Right, okay then. Sharon, Tracy, do you want to stand back a little bit? Not really. Right, okay. Tracy, try a bit of haggis first. There we go. Mummy, okay. get in there. Have a little go at that. Oh, right, you first, Tracy. What does that taste like? I don't know what it tastes like. No, it's nice though. It's quite, um... Is it oaty? Yeah. The texture's very oaty. Right. Tastes quite herby. Right, herby well that's mostly it? pork lung in that apparently. <laughs> what? <laughs> Mum went, you would said lung for that. I didn't right, say well, can, lung. Can, can, can I have a go? Of course you can, please. Right, okay, here we go. I've never really had it, I think I've had it before, but not like this. This this seems very, in fact you see little bits of oats and what, pearl barley in there or something? Not much flavour. It's very chewy. 
And as soon as you put it in your mouth, it breaks up. Mm. A little bit salty, I can taste a bit of salt in there. But I can taste pepper in there. Yeah, that is okay. But as you can see, come nearer, shall I look? The texture, as you as you um, pull it apart, it does crumble apart. So I think it's supposed to do that. Just <laughs> tread that in. <laughs> Not bad. Where's my fork gone? Over here. Mm. Right, yeah, I'm happy with that. I could eat that again. That's the normal black pudding there. So have a go at that. You've got a bit of your in if you want to try that bit of your in. Yeah. yeah. Let her go first, yeah. Right, now this is the, um, the Stowe, Stowe, Stowman's or something. What's that like as a black pudding? They all raved about this in the uh, comment section. I don't actually like black pudding. Right. But that's, that's, that's all right. Right, now before you go any further, taste it compared to that one. That is the one we had, or I've been having, uh, just a general black pudding. Can you taste the difference first of all? This one is more... Um claggy in your mouth claggy right i love that word shall let's see what you think of it you've got quite a delicate little palate haven't you shall yeah that's the good one now taste it compared to the other one sharon See what you think of the difference. Oh, see if there is a difference and which one, which one do you actually prefer? That one's more moist, isn't it? Looking well, you ain't had the other one, one yet. No, I'm looking by the side. See, I prefer that one. You I prefer that one? You both do. Fresh mm. one. I, now you've intrigued me. That's more... Flavoursome. More oniony and... Mm. Give, let me have a go. Mm. This is the stow, stow, stow something or Oh, hello, did you miss my mouth? I don't know how. I don't know how, no. <laughs> it's nice. Yeah, it's, it's tasty. Creamy texture. Claggy. I use the word creamy. <laughs> this one's the one I've been used to. I think you're right, I prefer that one. Mm. The other flavours coming through that. I'd say, I'd go as far as say oniony. Mm. Yeah, so you said, so I said yeah. Oh, did you? Yeah. Mm. yeah. That's still a good black them. pudding, that one. I'm not, it's I'm not better than the black pudding we get at home. Oh, that's well, crap. This is proper black but pudding. It's the first time I had that this week here. That's lovely. Yeah. Right, Sharon, go on in. Have a go at one of them. Salt and pepper chicken already prepared by, is it Anders, Anderson's Butchers? In Bucky, isn't it? Mm. Yes. What are they like? Well, they're not dry, they're quite moist. Tasty. Tracy, have a go at them. Already prepared. Mm. Nice big portion. And there's an after kick. Oh, yeah. They are a bit spicy. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. Mm. <laughs> now, that's your thing, Tracy. Um. Oh, bottle of wine, oh. glass of wine. Gin, actually. Now, try it with that new mayonnaise there. Just have a little scrape of that. Now see what that's like. That's only a plain mayonnaise, by the way, but see if it does anything. Not really? Not really. It's just a mayonnaise, though, isn't it? Can I have a go? Can I just... Well, go on in. What are you doing now? Trying to taste it. Perhaps oh. put it on your finger on its own. Mm. I didn't know. There's a funny taste to it to me. That's why yeah. I love it. It's lacking something, or is it flavourless? It's flavourless, isn't it? Yeah, it is. is it? Can I have a go? I'm going to do what you've done first. I'm going to put my finger in it because I don't want to contaminate it. You're right, there's not much flavour to it, but I would use that as a dip. Yeah, Maybe add some garlic Garlic, to it. I was just going to say, yeah. yeah. So let's have a go at these. Very crunchy, very crisp. The more you chew them, the more burn you get. Mm. So now I'm going to do it with that. They're a bit dry. Oh, I didn't think they were dry at all. But that brings moisture to the party. Mm. I'm happy with that. Right, these are supposed to have inside them a 
sauce. Pe peppercorn sauce. So let's cut through. Go down there, Tracy. I don't know whether it's going to work. Oh, there's something in there. Oh, well, yeah, well, it's oh, not yeah. a lot. Not a lot, mind you. No. There's a little pocket there. So let's just cut that down there. They are cooked, they're red hot, actually. Yeah, I mean, that's a very tiny amount of peppercorn sauce there, isn't it? Yeah. So let's just cut that down a minute. It's like a scotch egg, isn't it? Yeah, it's without like a... Like, well, without the egg, yeah. Yeah. Or a peppercorn ball without the peppercorn. <laughs> right, go on then, in you go. In you go. I don't know who's the two. Go on, sp spear it. No, I'm not like you. It'll be like um, sausage meat. I think it, it is, is sausage, sausage meat. Sausage meat, definitely. Any good? Oh, hot. hot, obviously hot. Right, did you get any peppercorn sauce for it? No. I'm going to have a little go. Right. Mmm. Yeah. I'm not getting no peppercorn sauce with it at all. Yeah. So as far as peppercorn sauce goes, but this it's nice. It's a tangy sausage meat, isn't it? Do you mind that? Yeah, it's um it reminds me of something. Oh, oh here yeah. it comes. Mm. Don't want to go? I'll write down in a minute. No, we'll do it now. Let's let these out. Polly's He just walked straight through, didn't he? Oh, so what do we think then? All in all. Haggis. Thumbs up. Would you have it again? The dear black pudding. Don't forget that tube cost me nine pounds. I would eat it again, yeah. Have a go at that, Ben. See what you think of that. That is a bacon covered sausage pork meat, sausage it's meatball. Bacon. Supposed to be with black pepper, uh, peppercorn sauce, but I can't taste it. Can you? No. No. That's your chicken bites. Oh, try the like, mayo. You might get a bit of burn. No, no, I don't mayo. Oh, just You love mayo, it, Benji. Me. You love mayo. Yeah, but look how nice mayo it is. Just try it. It's only olive oil, it's mayo. It's it's mayo. Avocado oil. I love the crunch. Like, I love the like crunching the noise you make. Yeah, I like the mayo. Oh, that you, tastes, you actually. I just had a bit off the fork. When I used to be a hairdresser. Oh, yeah. And I'd wear gloves to put a colour on. Of course you do. Help the safety. I'd take the gloves off. And sometimes by accident, I might nice. put my finger in my mouth or touch Accidentally. Mouth, and it tastes like that, the residue of the gloves. Lovely. Try the haggis now, black pudding. Black pudding and haggis. What's your thought, Tracy? These are quite nice, these. Try, try the haggis. You know that. Come on, try, try the haggis, stuff. Benji. Come on now. Pick a big bit up, Ben. He's trying to. We're dainty. Yeah, he's got a little, 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 uh, little delicate lady's touch, isn't he? That's the that is the right. right. Oh yeah. Okay. So There's two stop. types of black pudding here now. Tell us the best. Tell us the best one. That one. What you got there? One over the back there. Next. Savour the flavour. Oh, I like that. Oh yeah. I rhyme. I do rhymes. I do things like that. Yeah. Rhyming words. Why don't you just pick that big? And that one up, Benji. Tell us what you think is the best black pudding. Let me know, Benji. Savour that it. one. Yeah, well, You're well, joking, well. same as well. You've said the same. That's the cheaper one, Ben. Yeah, that's like it's got too much what packing in it or something. Is it claggy in your mouth? Yeah, it's yeah. got like is it claggy or creamy? <coughs> I call it creamy, Benji. I call it claggy. I love the word creamy, Benji. It's uh like too wheaty. It's got oh, so he's, he's capitalizing on the bleak, you only know, good one. <laughs> anyway, well, there you go, folks. Don't quite know what to make of that. That black mm. pudding is nice to stow. Stow, I can't remember the second name of it. Right. Right. Nothing, nothing's a fail there. Yeah, it's almost like it's got too much filling yeah. it. It's not a fail, but we did prefer that other one. And there's like extra flavours in that other one as well, aren't there? Mm. Oh, come on, let's have a look, Tracy. Oh, yeah, yeah, look, I mean, look, that's, 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 that's billed as a peppercorn sauce stuffed one. That's not really filled, filled at all, is it? So, if you're watching Anderson's, is it Anderson's, Tracy? Mm -hmm. Have a little work. I suggest that you freeze the peppercorn balls in an ice cube and then mould the sausage around it. Maybe that's a better point. They've probably been injected, Tracy. Well, there you go, folks. I hope you've enjoyed today's video. It's not as long as our normal ones, but at the end of the day, we're on holiday. Yeah. And we're having a bit of fun. And I better hurry up because he's eating all the bleating good stuff and leaving me the crumbs. Thanks very much, folks. Don't forget to check out our other videos. There's plenty of videos on our channel. 
vlogs, food videos, all that sort of stuff, taste, taste tests and all that shit, and where we go out on holiday, you're coming with us as well. Thanks very much, we'll see you in the next video. She's giving it to the blinking dog, it cost me a fortune. <laughs> Bye for now. <laughs>